guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brooke and today I am going to be doing my daughter's room tour. Um, I did just post a video of me redecorating her room. I put a whole bunch of shelf stuff in her room um, and changed it all up. So before you watch this video, go ahead and watch that one first so you guys kind of understand what her room looked like before. Wow, it just got really bright. <laughs> but anyways, um, so that's what I'm going to be showing you guys now is her room. She's currently in there playing with toys. So let me go ahead and try and get her distracted out of there. And then I will go ahead and show you guys her room. So this is just a little overview of what her room does look like. Um, just a little room. Yeah, don't mind the V missing there. I dropped it and can't find it. It's on the floor somewhere. But anyways, um, so as soon as you walk into her room over here is a bathroom. So not showing you guys that. But um, here is her door. Um, and then there is her diaper bag on there. And then right next to the bathroom is gonna be this cube that we do have. And then in here, I just have well, on top. I'm picture that she got from her aunt for Christmas. And then I just have this cute little welcome sign. This box underneath of it has all of her like keepsakes in it, like her first binky that's from the hospital, stuff like that. Um, this candle, it's never been lit, nutcracker. She gets a nutcracker from her grandma every Christmas and this was obviously her first Christmas, so she has one. Um, these were flowers that Kobe got me for Valentine's Day. And then this cute rustic looking fan. And then right under here, I just made this a, about a month or two ago of her with her foot and her hand in there. And then down in here is just wipes and Q-tips, things like that for her. And then in here, it's supposed to be her socks, but there's a random diaper in here. And then this I just got yesterday for her birthday coming up in a couple of days. And then underneath there is all of her books. Next to the cube is just gonna be my closet. I have all of my clothes in there, um, like I did say in my video before. And then I just have a mirror right here. I got this mirror just from Walmart and then I nailed it up there. So there's that. Next to the mirror, I have this sign, which I got months ago. Like I got it a long time ago, probably like four or five months ago, maybe last summer. And you're supposed to put pictures of their months and I never did so I should probably do that or take it down I, I don't know anyways so underneath that I just have some of my purses and bags hanging up on this little moon thing um, underneath her window is just this basket full of blankets and then on top of it there's just this little headrest thing I don't know anyways there's a whole basket of blankets in there and then there again is the sign that's missing the V. I have no idea where the V went at all. Um, it's probably just underneath there somewhere, but I have no idea where I put it. So I need to find it. I have a bag like full of other letters. So hopefully there's another V in there. I'll just go ahead and put it in there. But anyway, so um, underneath that, I just have this little like keepsake box and uh, me and Cubby, we write like notes to each other. It's kind of cheesy, but we put all of our notes in there that we have written to each other. Let's see how many we actually have in there. Um, Addison's gonna mess with the sign. Anyways, um, and then there's this book right here that I've made Addison. And then here's another like memory book that you're supposed to write in. But here's all these, let's see. Here's all these letters that yeah, we just like write a bunch of letters to each other and then I put them in there. So, kind of cheesy, but that's what we do. I thought it was really cute. So, put that in there. There's her wipe warmer. And then here's this little cubby thing. Her diapers go up in here, which I need to fill it up again. Um, and then there's a bunch of more wipes in here. Oh gosh. And then down in here, just all of her lotions and her bath soaps. And then here's some 
like hair detangler stuff, which I really like. So that's what's in there. Next to this, I have her toys, one of her unicorns she got for Christmas, and then one of her walkers that she's actually been trying to walk with. She is not walking yet, but she is um, close to walking. So I will be going ahead and doing a one year update really soon, probably my next video that will get uploaded. So if you wanna know kind of her milestones and what she's doing right now, since she's almost one, make sure to be watching for that video. But um, like I said in my last video, I did go ahead and put these shelves up. Um, I already did have the shelf there, but it was in like the corner kind of coming at an angle. Now it's just like more long and easier to get clothes. So watch that last video if you wanna see how I did that. Um, I just put her stuffed animals up top there and then I have like OCD, so I put them all in color order. <laughs> Anyways, um, underneath of here is all of her shoes and she has like so many shoes I have to stack some of them but yeah she grows out of them really fast and baby shoes are actually way cheaper than like adult shoes so that's why she has so many anyways um next i have in the corner i just have this little mirror and i made this mirror for really cheap i actually made it for like under ten dollars so i thought it was just really cute it'd be a cute like nursery i guess idea to do like a whole sunroom like sunflower room that'd be so cute anyways so i just have that mirror there Next, I just have this long dresser, and on top of it, I just have some of my lotions and perfumes, the sign and the flower, this picture of Addison, and then next to it, I just have this jewelry thing, and it actually has um, me and Cubby stuff on it, and then this is her right here. This is her little mini bracelet down here, and then those are her little sunglasses um, up there as well. Um, this thing, I really love this. I actually got it as a gift from Kobe's grandma. She bought it for her and she wasn't using it. So she gave it to me and I really, really love this. It's so perfect for Addison. So this basically is like a projector and it puts things up on the ceiling um, right next to Addison's crib. So it puts like stars up on the ceiling and it's so cute at nighttime. And it's also a essential oil diffuser thing so you can put lavender in it and it makes them sleep a little bit longer i love it it's so cute and so small and i just love how it puts the stars up on the ceiling so i really do like that and i recommend that i'm pretty sure she got it from um tj maxx or marshall's and it was like 20 dollars and like, it's really cheap so go ahead and get one of those if you do have a kid because it's really a good idea Anyways, in her dresser, I do have a bunch of hair bows up here, hair ties, things like that. For her birthday, I did want to go get one of those signs that hold all your bows, so she'll probably have that in here next. And then there's just her purses that she has um, hanging up there. And then in this top drawer, she just has all of her pajamas up there. This drawer, she has all of her onesies. And then this drawer, she has all of her pants and she has so many, there's like 30 piles in here. And then in this last drawer, she just has um, her towels, these swaddle burp cloths, which I never ever use those and I have so many of them. And then burp rags, all that. So that's what's in that last drawer. Addison, you wanna shut it for me? Okay, you can, you can play in there if you want. <laughs> And then next to the dresser is just going to be her crib, and this is what it looks like. I have this cute little sign up here, um, which is adorable. I got that be way before she was born. And then don't mind the little gash in the door when I was... I've rearranged Addison's room like five times, and I've just marked it up from doing that. Anyway, so this is just her crib. Um, I understand that that doesn't match. I will be getting a new one. I used to have like a whole set that matched, but I didn't really like it because when Addison was first born, I was like really like a tomboyish, not tomboyish, but like I liked grays and elephants and stuff. But now I turned more into like a girly girl, I guess you could say. And I love pinks and all that type of stuff. So I definitely, um, I did have like a matching set that was elephants, but I don't like it anymore. So I just put a new fitted sheet in there and have to get a new skirt for it. Anyways, so just in her crib, I just have some more blankets, a binky, and pillows. So there's that. And then next to it, I have this little rocking chair, which she got um, for Christmas. And then in it, in this little basket, I just have all of these hats. I've been getting so many for her. This one's so cute. We're going to the Indians game at the end, like two days after her birthday. So I got this for her. I thought it was really cute. Um, and then she has just a bunch of other hats in here and these little mittens and then all these beanies. 
so she has a whole bunch of hats already and then this little sun hat both of these sun hats for like the summer which i thought were really cute and so she doesn't get like sunburn and all that and then she has this cute little sign on her door that says welcome to my crib which i thought was so funny <laughs> but that is everything for her room tour i hope you guys like this video and it gave you guys a little bit of inspiration for your guys's nursery i know I loved watching all these videos because I had no idea what I wanted to do for my nursery. And like I did say, whenever Addison was first born, I was like really like liked grays, elephants, like gold stars, things like that. But now I definitely don't. I really like like pinks. So I definitely needed some like inspiration. So I love getting on Pinterest and looking at things like that. When we do move. I probably will do another room tour because we will be moving soon. And her room obviously won't look like this. So um stay watching for that make sure you subscribe so you guys do see those videos and i think that is it for this video so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one bye guys